Hey gardeners, Enlightenment Garden, November 4th. And today is day one of the pond build. If you're new to this channel, I'm out in the Phoenix, Arizona area, garden zone 9B. I have quite a few fruit trees in the yard and I wanted to add a pond this year just for the aesthetics, for the, the peaceful sounds of water. Um, also, this will house goldfish. And also the, the waste from the pond can actually fertilize my trees. So it really is an ecosystem type pond. So the builder's pond gnome, they're out in Peoria, Arizona. Uh, luckily a person fell out and so my, my construction date moved up to this week. So I'll just point out the logistics here. You can see that at the back, we do have some retaining block wall. That's where the fill dirt will go as they excavate. Right in front there is a bio falls. It's a two foot tall waterfall. It's going to empty and splash into this area. And then there's going to be a stream that curves around and then dumps water into this eight by 10 foot pond. So it's a combo pond, waterfall, and stream. What I really like about Pond Gnome is they're very transparent about um, their, their pond prices. So it is an investment to do a, a pond. This pond um, with tax, everything is um, just over $12,000. So it is not a cheap thing, but it is very labor intensive, not just the excavation that they have to do, here you can see their excavator that they're using, um, but all of the boulder work that needs to happen to rock this out properly. And the plumbing. The skimmer is going to be located right in this section here, and that's actually where my autofill will tie into. So as the sun evaporates the water just like a swimming pool, there's a line, ball valve that opens, allows water to come in. So it's incrementally, constantly um, keeping that water level correct for the fish. So I'm excited to take you on this, uh, this journey. I'll be doing updates each day as progress is made and showing you each, each step here. Thanks for watching and happy gardening.